The name of the business is Studio 212 Hair Salon, and we are on Main Street. We're right next to Panache and the Rosa Theater. Um, it's very easy to find us here. Um, you'll see the mosaics out front, and oh, then you'll yes, know that you found us. The mosaic tiles out front are gorgeous. Tell us about your salon, and how did you come to be in Wapaka? I came to be in Wapaka because my father moved here, and we used to come and visit him all the time, and we always loved this little town. So when we moved, had the opportunity to move here, we came here, and I worked for about a year and a half in another salon, and we just decided to make the big leap of faith and open our own salon. So that's how we came to be, in a so shortened has, version. Has this been your location from that change then? Yes, we have not moved. We've been here since 1996. Oh, 1996, that's quite a history. Yeah. What do you like about doing business in Wapaka? The people here are amazing. I mean, I can't say enough good things about how wonderful they are, and it's just they're kind, and they always go a little bit extra. I mean, you're in a bigger city, you know, there's virtues there too, but you just get a lot more personal attention. And we know each other, and we take care of each other. We are a full-service salon, so we offer we hair services, waxing services. We also do massage and facials, and um, of course, color services. I don't know, manicures, pedicures. And I see that there is a full line of products as well as jewelry and other things. Yeah, we like to do things that are local, so we have some local artists, and then we do go out and we try to find things that are interesting. We don't do a lot of other retail other than Aveda. We are an Aveda concept salon, so that is our main focus, but we like to have a little unexpected thing here or there. We believe strongly in our community and serving our community, so not only do we do services for our guests, but you may find us out in the community actually doing things. Um, this year we went to Hartman's Creek and we helped create a, a butterfly garden. Mm, so everybody donned, we got our hose out and dug up some earth and moved some things around and it's very it's doing very well so giving back to the community absolutely so every year we try to do at least one thing um, we try to do things at holiday for special families that need a little bit extra help oh. we do what we can mm -hmm. that sounds wonderful and what goes around comes around because it, it comes back to us as well